Coach, so what are you experiencing right now? Well, we're extremely excited um, to, to make the playoffs two years in a row. This team has played extremely well. We played a very difficult schedule um, this season, and um, and we finished strong. And so I'm really proud for the guys. They've earned the right to continue to play and, um, you know, have a chance at winning the championship. So we're really excited, and um, our process starts all over again today as we get ready for our next opponent. What do you do now going forward? Um, well, we just start practicing getting, and, and improving on the skills that um, we need to get better at. Um, you know, this is a familiar opponent, um, but both teams are a little different now. You know, we, it's been a long time since we played each other. Um, so I imagine they've kind of, um, you know, kind of kind of found their rhythm and we've kind of found our rhythm. That's a little different than what it was early in the year. So it'll be exciting. Um, it's good to be playing close to Birmingham, um, and, and it would be good for our players because a lot of our, our families can be able to come watch us play in this first round of the playoffs. I mean, the FCS playoffs are you know, different in the way that you got so many teams. Like you said, kind of a familiar opponent. What do you know at this point about Kansas State? Um, well, you know, they're an option team. and Their only defeat is um, when we knocked them off at the beginning of the season. They're the conference champions out of the Big South. Um, and, and I just remember they were very tough and hard-nosed um, in the opener. But again, um, each team changes a lot from game one to the end of the season. So um, we'll get back to work, get our scouting report together, put the best plan together that we can possibly do um, to give our guys the best chance to succeed next Saturday. A little bit different feeling maybe from last year. Last year we were kind of holding our breath. This year we kind of knew we were in. Uh, but still just as exciting, right? Oh, well, there's no question about it. I mean, you, you, you know there's no guarantees in life. And, um, you know, we felt very confident that we had deserved a shot um, at the playoffs and um, felt very good about being in. But um, you just don't know until you until they call your name out. So it was, uh, um, you know, it's exciting. It's still a relief. Um, but I think our guys understand that, um, you know, we, we just don't want to make the playoffs. We want to take the next step. Um, and I think um, when our reaction really um, kind of um, highlighted that today. So say about our, our conference, we got four in last year, get three in this year, a tough Furman team we just saw. Uh, it's got to say a lot about the conference. Well, it does, and it bodes well. And I think, um, you know, each week um, it, it's a battle. And we, all the teams in our league are very tough. Um, and, this, um, and, and this year was no different. So um, it speaks a lot about the competition that we have. It speaks a lot about the type of players and coaches that are in this league. All right, so what are you doing this, like, when is the game plan installed? When are you, like, how fast are you moving forward at this point? Um, as soon as we get through talking right here, we will we'll get started. And we've already started earlier this morning on um, breaking down last night's game. So, um, you know, we, we don't have much time, so we got to get to work. Okay, thank you. Duck, uh, obviously, it's always exciting to, to hear our name called. Though, what were the feelings when we saw our name up on the screen this morning? I mean, you know, this year was a lot different from last year. You know, I think we all had an idea that a good idea that we were definitely getting in. So, uh, just you know, a lot of excitement about who we were going to get, who we we're going to play, and you know, we definitely like the matchup. Get to go play in Georgia. Got a lot of people on the team from Georgia, so hopefully, have a big crowd there at the game. Does it make it any different knowing that we have played this team before? We're a little more familiar. Oh, I mean, yeah, of course it does. You know, it's. it's it's, it's tough to beat a, a team, the same team twice in uh, in the same season. But you know, I definitely like our group, and definitely like a like our, like our team to be able to, to beat them twice in the same season. And uh, you know, definitely playing them. Uh, we played them first game, so I'm sure both teams have improved throughout the season. I know that we were their only loss, so I know they've definitely gotten a lot better. I think we're improving too, so it's going to be another good matchup. I know the offense has definitely uh, come a long way from that first game. We were still kind of trying to figure things out. And it seems like we're clicking right at the right time. Oh, yeah, that, I mean, definitely clicking at the right time on both sides of the ball. I mean, defense, I mean, gosh, they've let like only like 28 points in the last three, four games. So, I mean, they're playing great. And offense, we're finally, you know, really starting to click. And I still don't think we've reached our peak. So, that's good that we can still uh, increase each week. Coach talked about how last year we were glad to make it, but this year we want to make that next step. Uh, how important is it to the guys to, to know that making it's not enough? We need to kind of go forward. Oh, I mean, definitely got to go for it. I mean, that's been our goal since day one is going for it. So, you know, now that we're in here and now we have the opportunity. Uh,
All right, so a lot of excitement in there right now, but the, these playoffs can be a long, arduous run if you're doing well. What's the mindset going to be like now going forward to kind of buckle back down? I mean, you know, you got to have the same mindset, uh, you know, just focus on one week at a time. You know, it's a lot different than the playoffs because you don't know when your last week could be. Um, there's no guarantee. You don't have a guarantee of next week, so you got to come out each and every day, you know, practice, do the little things and focus, and, uh, you know, we just want to out fun each team each week. Okay, like Coach said, you know, work starts now, what do you plan on doing, you know, at this moment to get ready for this game? Um, right after this, probably going to get some breakfast, but uh, I know Coach said that they're going to send us a text message, uh, text, a text of the uh, schedule for the day, so we'll kind of see uh, what we got going on today, start watching film, breaking it down, and uh, just getting prepared to go play Kennesaw.